Well, the 2019 uh, vintage for Fay was really a spectacular vintage. Grapevines are drought tolerant plants, and in these kind of drier years, you tend to produce wines that are very expressive. You're able to get control of the vines uh, earlier in the season and really dial in uh, your farming. You know, the yields were, were lower, and that does tend to produce uh, more intensity in terms of flavors. Just when you smell the wines, they're oozing with aromatics, I think particularly from that cooling period during the summertime. You know, when you put it in line with other vintages, I wouldn't say 19 is like a big, ripe power year, like let's say uh, 2013. You know, nor is it kind of on the more softer, elegant side, let's say like, uh, like 2014. Um, it's something that's kind of in the middle, but it just has a lot of really nice flavor, uh, flavor intensity. You couldn't be happier about the vintage. Um, you know, I feel like in terms of how we were managing in the vineyard, we were able to get to that ripeness level that we wanted. You know, Faye has all these wonderful unique, uniquenesses within the vineyard. Different clones, different rootstocks, different row orientations different planting densities, different, different trellis sides, and each one of those individual blocks out there produces a slightly different version of Fae, slightly different characters. And to, for me to be able to work with that vineyard, uh, it's very fun <laughs> because you do, you wind up with all these different complexities, all these different sizes, all these different things to choose from uh, when we're putting together uh, that final blend. But the vibrancy of Fae is what also is really Fun. You go back and you open up vintages of Fay from um, the mid 90s right now, um, and you get that signature perfumey note. We were able to kind of extend the season so that we were able to get the grapes to be ripe um, and very expressive in terms of characteristics. That's what I find really in all of our state wines. What I'm excited about them is because they are expressive and with our two estate vineyards, that's what's so unique about them. You know, they're planted right next door to each other, but they have a different personality. And particularly talking now about 2019 Fay, I mean, when you taste and smell Fay Vineyard Cabernet, you know, it has this alluring perfumey note to it. And it's almost like it's a, a berry, you know, it's like a berry pie, like you bite into a berry pie or something just comes out. It's very aromatic, very expressive. And in the 19 vintage, it's a full on expression uh, of Faye. Hope you enjoy your 2019 vintage Faye Cabernet. Cheers.